Okay, boys, there's three of us and one of him. All we have to do is go ambush him and focus the tank, I think. Go! 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 Oh, crap, he dashed through that. And there's three of them. I clearly did not think this through. At least I'm focusing the carry. And I did not eat Tristana's balls. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. And my teammates died. Might want to ignore that part. Welcome to the League of Legends Troll Spotlight. Featuring Chuck Norris, the one guy in Dynasty Warriors you can't kill in one hit. Jarvan is a tank, melee, fighter, bruiser, AD, caster, top, mid, jungler, support, carry, champion. Jarvan excels at every single role he plays because he's Chuck Norris, and Chuck Norris can do what he want. Because Jarvan is Chuck Norris, he does not need a hidden passive to help him out. Jarvan's actual passive, Martial Cadence, allows Jarvan to do extra damage every 6 seconds to any minion or champion. Jarvan's Q and E are Dragon Strike and Demacian Standard. While Demacian Standard allows Jarvan to throw a pole and reveal an area around that pole, Dragon Strike allows Jarvan to pull out his slightly longer pole and use that pole to pull himself towards his other pole. Jarvan's W, Golden Aegis, allows Jarvan to throw a big white wave around him that slows down his opponents. Jarvan's ultimate, Cataclysm, allows him to long-range dunk his opponent and trap them inside a circle. If you think most of Jarvan's skills are rapist innuendos, you're completely wrong, because Chuck Norris does not need to rape you. You rape yourself. Wait. That doesn't even make any sense. Because Jarvan naturally does a ton of damage, he does not need any Trinity forces. As such, my focus when I build Jarvan is mainly health, with a little bit of tankiness, along with Atmos and Black Cleaver for extra damage. So, Masteries, Rune Page, Summer Spell, uh... Um... That's, uh, totally not from my secret... Puppy collection. Um... Give me a second. As I was saying, I always gank mid when there's a LeBlanc there. Fortunately, when I go in on the LeBlanc, she was dumb enough to flash out. whoop de doo as I tell you kids all the time, you always need to ward your blue. Because I actually never tell you that, but just just do it from now on, because you never know when Nocturne is going to come and take your blue. Like now. Uh, unfortunately, Lux misses both her skills, but I attempt to go in on him with my poles, and it hits him somehow and knocks him up. Again, totally not a sex reference there. Seeing Tristana bot, I decided to gank her. By that, I mean stand in a bush for about 5 seconds. Ash actually hits her arrow for once, I hit Tristana with my pole, and grab her in with my ultimate, because my ultimate does that now. Don't question the game! The game can do what he wants, and I'm assuming the game is a guy. After flashing and going with my pole, and as I'm about to hit Tristana in the face, Ash takes my kill. Oh, hello Nocturne, you wanna fight me? Well, sorry to inform you, but Ash is right there, and she is about to come and help me. Right now. Ash. 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 I said Ash. You bitch. Okay, we're gonna try this again, and this time, I am not going to die. Hello. What the hell just happened? Like I said, the game does what he wants. After Lutch executes that Teemo, I immediately go on to Tristana and ult her. Unfortunately for me, Soraka's banana was powerful enough to secure the kill. Well, at least I didn't die. Players are advised to take serene moments such as this to come down and meditate. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh, hello Tristana, I see we meet again. You did! Bitch! This is what you get for not jumping away! Who? Eat my pole! Nice work, Ash. Uh, 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 field goal. It's okay, we didn't need to stun that LeBlanc anyways. Seeing some action mid, me and Lux rush towards there in order to kill LeBlanc. Unfortunately, Ash took a little bit of a detour and died. Uh, but... I don't really care. Of course, I am where the action is. And by that I mean mid. And by action I mean getting hit by towers. Uh, after finishing off this little minion, I see that Garen and uh, the other guy, Soraka, that's her name, is going in on their Nocturne. I go in and ult him. 
That was totally my kill. Totally. Okay, let's go and catch Nocturne. Go, Ash! Good job! Seeing Renekton trying to commit suicide after taking our hib, I immediately go on him. A well-timed ult allowed me to secure the kill. That was totally unnecessary, but pretty awesome. Realizing that LeBlanc is in the jungle, I immediately go on her. Unfortunately, she jukes me out because I'm completely stupid, and Lux kind of misses her ult. So she survived with full health. I realized that I don't really give a shit anymore, so I decided to go and solo their tower by myself without any minions, because I'm Jarvan and I have enough health to do that. In any case, I thought it would be a good change of pace, and I would be helping out my team by not being in any of the team fights. Like that one. Where... It's okay, I'm still fighting the tower, and it's not doing- oh. Um... I'm helping out. Hello, Renekton, top of the morning to- oh, crap, I'm just gonna make my exit now. If you excuse me. Uh, just maybe stop chasing me, I mean, the, the, the towers do do enough damage to me to maybe kill me a little bit. Um, you, you can just not chase me, if that would be fun. It would be fun. It's always fun to not chase anybody. See? I got away! And that's all that ma- oh, shit, he's still here. Oh, crap, that Teemo. Well, Garen, bitch, you go take care of, uh, that Renekton over there. I will run away. Hello, Teemo! Gadunt! Yeah! That's what I thought. Nice work, Ash. See? Everybody survived that. I don't know why I pulled out that accent, but I do what I want. After a little while, we decide to chase both Teemo and Tristana, even though that's not really possible. And, uh, congratulations, Ash, you deserve a medal. Lux OP. Okay, you and me, Tower, one-on-one. -on -one. Let's go! Let's go, I ain't afraid of you! Does it look like I'm afraid of you? No, I'm smacking you. I'm smacking you with all my... poles and shit. Oh. Um, I- I will be leaving- I'll be back! I will be back, Tower. Hello, Teemo! See, Tower, I told you I'll be back. You dead. That's what I thought. I ain't afraid of you. Shh. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting barons. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go, go, go! Oh, crap, we were late. Hello, gentlemen. We are just here to help with the, uh, baron killing, you know. The usual. No, Tristana, I will not eat your balls. Uh, I'm just gonna leave now. Oh, uh, somebody go help that Lux. M maybe Ash. Ash, maybe come help. That is all I have to say about that. Well, at least we somehow won that team fight. And of course, she's gonna take this kill too. You bitch. Oh, give me a home where the towers will roam and me smacking you in the face. With Ash being a bitch and a bunch of other shit and we smacking stuff in your base. You know what, Ash? We're actually not doing that bad. You and I, we could get along together pretty well. Nope! Never mind, I'm out! Uh, you're on your own, Ash. I don't give a shit. Hello, Mr. Tower. Do you wish to duel me? Of course you do. No, LeBlanc, no! Me and this tower, we have this, uh, preordained, uh, little agreement here where I smack him with my pole and he sh shoots stuff in my face. You shall not be the one who ruins our agreement. Leaving my allies to go and defend our base, I decide, well, why not? Let's go take their inhibitor. Unfortunately for me, I, uh, well, that happens. Hello, Timo. Fortunately for me, I can actually solo Timo by myself and he's completely scared of me. So, as uh, I kind of drive him off, I continue back smacking the inhibitor. Oh, hello, Timo. Do you wish to fight me yet again? Oh, son of a bitch. Now, about our previous arrangement, LeBlanc, you are a very, uh, nice lady, so perhaps we should rethink this. Ah, poop. Perhaps I should have been paying attention to the Nexus. Well, that is it for this episode of Troll Spotlight. 
We will see you next time.